In this video, we're going to talk about just basically about some cPanel logs that you can use just to find out some interesting stats and details. So we're going to cover just a few. We're going to cover the AW stats, which kind of gives you an idea of how much traffic your website's getting. Uh, there's a security panel that you might want to be interested in. There's a latest visitors tab that you can check out just to see who you know what type of traffic that you're getting at your website that's all very important very relevant so let's head over to cpanel we'll go ahead and look first of all at our latest visitors tab here it's just a it's right here in the logs area and again you can move these around if these are something that you use all the time you can move it to the very top um, let's check out the latest visitors and this is the url that we're going to view the domain and you can see who your latest visitors are, where they're visiting, and what type of traffic you're getting. We also have the AW stats here. Now, there's not a bunch of stats regarding this particular website yet because it's I don't even have a website actually on the domain yet. But this is where I'll go just to see how many visitors my website is getting. Um, We've got error logs here. We've got the Webalizer tab is also another one that has uh, some great traffic stats that we can check out. And I believe that's it. We did want to check out the security tab here. So we do have some security areas. And if you ever need, um, you know to password protect some files this is where you would do it you can set up a password protect directory so uh, let's go ahead and go inside of this area and there's a video tutorial that'll give you exact details on how to get this all set up inside of your cPanel okay so that's kind of cool so you can go ahead and check that out but inside of this area it would require a username and password for anybody that wants to access that part of your site. So that's just adding a layer of protection that you can use to protect anything that you have in your site. Maybe it's some videos that you have. Uh, maybe they're just files that you have on your server. Things of that nature that you just want to put some extra protection on. Okay. So inside of cPanel, there's a wealth of information. Just wanted to touch briefly upon a few of them, mostly your stats, and you can you can kind of tell where your traffic's coming from and whether or not that's going to turn into dollars with your online marketing uh, business that you're creating. All right, so that's pretty much the end of this video. We'll talk about the password protection folder in more detail in the next video and um, we'll continue on until we have a website and everything active on our site on our url take care